Hey, big boy. Bob Elf here. Put your best bundies on, because Santa needs your help to deliver gifts. Like, Santa Santa? No, Santa Barbara. Yes, Santa. Now hurry up, I have an ear waxing appointment out to get to. And I can't babysit you all day, so are you in? Count me in. I mean, sir, Mr. Bob Elf. I'll be there. Time to deliver these gifts. Hey guys, we are back for another episode with CapCut Online. Are you ready to turn those holiday videos into something fun and entertaining? Well, you're right on time because today we're diving into CapCut Online with speed ramp, voice changing, keyframing, and effects. Alrighty creators, let's dive into the nitty gritty of CapCut Online and bring our holiday story to life. I'll walk you through each step by step and the equipment I use to make this come to life. But before we begin guys, don't forget to hit that subscribe button so you're always going to get notifications when our new episodes come out. They're pushing out super consistently with a ton of new knowledge and I can't wait to share it with you guys. Let's get started. First up, we're gonna be working on the speed ramping effect. This is perfect for adding drama to any sort of action. And in our case, this is gonna be my Santa transformation. To create this effect, you will need just your phone camera, a tripod, and Santa outfit. Begin by recording yourself spinning a few times without the outfit. Then in a separate take, put on the Santa outfit and spin in the exact same spot. It's crucial to maintain consistency by spinning slowly and steadily in both takes. Once you've finished filming, head over to CapCut Online. Once you're in, go ahead and register or log in, even if you're already a CapCut Pro. Now for the first step, all you're gonna have to do is open up your CapCut project and import your clips just like this. Once all your footage is imported, drag it onto your timeline with a simple click or drag and drop action. Next, select the specific clip to which you want to apply the speed effect. After that, you're going to want to click on speed located on the controls tab and then choose curve. All right, so the next step that you're going to want to take is find where you want that speed change to happen. And for us, it's during the spin in my normal clothes and the spin in my Santa suit. The next thing you're going to want to do is adjust the speed curve. Modify the speed curve of the video clips to accelerate during the spin. Afterward, gradually revert to normal speed on the second clip, slowing down by the end of the spin. Once you've adjusted the speed, synchronize the cuts of each clip while spinning to ensure a smooth and seamless effect. Alright, so we're going to play it back and make sure that it captures those dramatic moments and hit play. Not half bad, right? Next up in our project, we're going to play with the voice changer effect. Now this is an amazing opportunity to take some regular audio and turn it into a fun character voice like Bob the Elf. Record a video of yourself while you're talking on the phone and ensure the audio is captured as well. So the first step in the voice changing effect is you're going to go into your timeline and select the audio clip for the effect. Then trim the sections of the clip where you intend to implement a voice change. The next step is pretty simple. You're going to want to click on audio and after that choose voice changer. All right, the next step, you're gonna have all of these options to choose from. There's quite the variety of voice effects and scroll through and see what they sound like. But for this specific project, I think we're going to want to go with the Elf one. And after that, all you gotta do is play the clip and hear the transformed voice. Oh? Hey, big boy, Bob Elf here. Put your best bundies on, cause Santa needs your help to deliver gifts. Next, let's go back to our Santa transformation scene and incorporate some of CapCut's diverse effects to enhance the video. And to elevate its appeal, we'll need to experiment with keyframes for that extra touch of coolness. Pick the effect you want and click to add it to your timeline. Adjust its duration to match your video for a seamless and impressive result. And to fine tune your creation even more, you can go in and adjust position, scale, and rotation between all these keyframes for that buttery smooth animation. 
You might have thought that was the last step, but the final final step is going to be combining it with a bunch of different other effects for that unique result. Go ahead and check out our Santa transformation scene and see what I mean. Alrighty guys, there you have it. Speed ramp for drama, voice changer for fun, and keyframes for dynamic motion all in CapCut Online. Alrighty, I want you to go out and experiment with these new effects to give your holiday videos a unique twist. Practice, play around, and see what amazing creations you can come up with. Thank you so much for turning in, and if you found this tutorial helpful, give it a thumbs up and subscribe for more editing tips and tricks. And as always, happy holidays and happy editing.